DevTech Media. Subscribe to DevTech Media. DevTech Media. Subscribe to DevTech Media. Even if President uh, Haka Indeichlema and myself had not sat down to agree on this partnership, the movement for multi party democracy still has a democratic right to support what is right and to say no to what is wrong. On 25th October 2021, the leader of the Movement for Multi-Party Democracy, MMD, Dr. Nevas Momba, announced the intention of his party to join the United Party for National Development, UPND Alliance, in a quest to contribute to the development of the country. The plans were advanced on 7th March 2022, when the party founder member, Henry Molenga, wrote an application that the MMD party, led by Dr. Momba, be admitted into the UPND Alliance. This decision has, however, not sat well with the MMD members, such as the immediate past National Mobilization Chairperson, Reverend Sylvia Nawa, who has charged that the MMD is not for auction to the highest bidder. I would like to remind Dr. Sequila Mumba and his henchmen that MMD is not for auction to the highest bidder. This is a movement whose tenets are embedded in its party constitution. The MMD has a spirit of collective decision making, not individualism. Hence, members too have rights according to the party constitution. Reverend Nawa, who was speaking at a press briefing in Lusaka Saturday morning, says Dr. Momba has already been expelled from the party as his tenure of office, according to the party's constitution, expired in April this year, and only the national convention can determine who the next leader will be. Calling upon my colleagues, I worked with during the time I was national chairperson for mobilization, to realize that Dr. Nevers Mumba is a failed politician who can never take any political party anywhere. Hence, they should come out and join hands with a progressive group of MMT members who are genuinely pushing for the restoration of democracy in our party. And MMD leader Gaston Sichilema says Dr. Momba has for years been trying to change the party's constitution, such as Article 41, which stipulates that the president of the party shall hold office for two terms of five years each and shall not be eligible for re-elections. You are all aware that the UPND government has been preaching rule of law. Now we wonder how they can be embracing Dr. Momba in the name of the alliance while he is raping the party constitution. This maneuver by Dr. Momba will not be taken lightly by Operation Save MMD as we are determined to defend our hard-end democracy in our party. Mr. Sichilima also says the judgment ruled by the court in favor of Dr. Mumba in 2019 will now be a thing of the past, considering that Dr. Mumba's tenure of office has come to an end and that party members themselves are the ones who have decided that he leaves the party. Meanwhile, efforts to get a comment from Dr. Mumba proved futile by broadcast time. Subscribe to DevTech Media. DevTech Media. Subscribe to DevTech Media.